then if you look over here, out the side, you'll see it looks like drain pipes. You'll see them all through the bridge. Um, well, they are exactly what they are. They're drain pipes. And whenever it like rains or snows or anything on the bridge, uh, right in the center of the bridge, there's a four and a half foot rise right in the middle. And what happens is when it rains and snows and everything, that rise allows the water to deplete to one side, and then it'll come and drain from the top through these pipes, and it'll rain down onto the trees. It sort of waters them like a plant. <laughs> Never cloudy here in the mornings, like big time fog on the yeah, actual. Yeah. The worst thing that we have to deal with is the wind. Not yeah. So much the wind. But y'all still do tours if it's foggy in the morning? Yeah. yeah, yeah. I was hoping to do a morning tour, but. We usually start our first tour at about 10 o'clock. Oh, nine cool. Yeah. And it's usually, sometimes it's still pretty, it's pretty foggy. Yeah, that'd be pretty cool. Especially down in the water. It's yeah. Kind of messy right above. It's yeah. Cool. If you guys look over here to your left, um, you see this beach right here where they're pulling the rafts in? Okay, on bridge day, the base jumpers and everything, people go down there and on that beach, they paint a 15 or 10 foot bullseye right on the sand of the beach. And uh, that's where the parachuters try and aim for when they jump off the bridge. Uh, I'm pretty sure if you land in the bullseye, you get like 10 bucks or something, but I'm not 100% for sure. <laughs> uh, I've actually, I've gone down there before because uh, a friend of mine, his dad was a police officer who got assigned to security, so we got to ride a shuttle bus down there, and I got to watch everybody come in and land, and it was, it was pretty cool. It was pretty neat watching them land. And uh, sometimes, a lot of people ask, well, what if they land in the water? We actually have a lot of people that do land in the water, even though they're all professionals, most of them. Uh, we have almost like jet boats, kind of speed boats, that we run, and it's, there's about three usually, and they run around this little cove right here constantly. And whenever people land in the water, they go and pick them up and get them on the paramedic boat before they get too tangled and something happens to them. So that's what, that's what they do. Has anybody been whitewater rafting? Did you guys go in this river? This one? Where'd you guys go? Montana. 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 Yeah.